Hi friends, so it looks like this is the way we're going to be meeting for the moment. And that's precisely what I'd like to address. We're not going to meet in Shul, we're not going to meet in the store. And we have to turn that into a positive. This is the way of the Jewish people. You're home now. I'm reminded of a caricature that I recently saw of a flight about to take off, the passengers, the look of terror on their faces, and the caption reading, Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain speaking. I'm happy to report that today I'm working from home. You see, you and I are at home. No distractions. The only ones that we are surrounded by are the people that we love most, and that is the opportunity. You see, friends, when Yaakov Avinu was in great distress, running from his brother Esau, he realized he was not going to make it to Shul. No community to daven with. And then suddenly it dawned on him, Ein zekim beisalakim bezeh shara shemayim, that those four cubics that he stood in, like his home in a sense, that was the home of God. And that was the pathway to heaven. The love that you have for your family and they to you, that is the holiest place on earth, folks, making your home the pathway to heaven. This Shabbos, when you're surrounded by your family and no distractions, celebrate the love for your family and each other. Certainly, in that way, God will answer our prayers, bringing back uh, the times of normality, and even more so, a time, Hashiva Shaktenu Kavod when you are Shalayim will wear its crown once more in great splendor, and we will all be davening in the greatest shul of all in the Beis HaMikdash. Reach out to your family in great love. Have a wonderful and happy, happy Shabbos. Look forward to seeing you soon. Good Shabbos.